What is the one herbal remedy that you wish that you knew how to make? I want to hear about it below. I'm really asking. And then I want you to ask yourself why you haven't been making that thing. Is it because you're intimidated? You're not sure how to go about it? You need a recipe? You're not sure if it's going to work? As somebody who has been teaching most of my life and specifically on herbs and essential oils for the last 20 years, those are a couple of the common reasons I see people holding back doing something that could really help to improve their health. The herbal remedy that I'm getting asked about the most right now is fire cider and it's because we're going into the challenging cold months of the year here in the northern hemisphere and fire cider is amazing for helping to support natural immunity. The people who have taken this class for me so far, the biggest feedback that I've gotten is that they are so surprised and shocked by how powerful everyday kitchen ingredients are to help to support our body. And that even by using more herbs and spices in their cooking day to day, they can improve their health. I love to help people learn more about this. It totally fires me up. And so I'm going to be offering a virtual live fire cider class where you can chop your garlic with me and shred your ginger with me and ask any questions that come up while we're going. I'm going to be talking all about the history of fire cider, the scandal of fire cider, and why the ingredients work the way that they do to help the body. You can find this on my website. It's highlighted by some red peppers, which is one of the 